Hi. Today, we'll guide you step by step on how to use layer aliases to expose simple layer names and perform updates without needing to change the exposed names. We will learn how to assign an alias to a layer and then reassign the alias to a different version of the layer so that users gain automatic access to the latest updates. We'll begin by opening the Skyline Globe Server Manager Layers page. Note the layer in the list with the alias Orlando Latest. Without making any modifications, let's open Terra Explorer and load this layer into our project. We select the option Load Layer by Alias so that the layer is loaded into the project by its alias and not by its ID. You'll see why in just a minute. Take a look at the display of the layer in the 3D window. Let's publish our project with this layer to Skyline Globe Server and open the published project in Terra Explorer. Next, we return to Skyline Globe Server, where we reassign the Orlando latest alias to a later version of this layer. Back in Terra Explorer, we refresh the Orlando latest layer. Since we had previously loaded the layer into the project by its alias, the layer immediately updates to the new version associated with this alias. Thanks for watching. For more information, check out our knowledge base at support.skylinesoft.com.